here we are folks at the old library the long room right here at trinity college here in dublin absolutely spectacular there's about five to six million books housed right here in the long room it really is spectacular One point two million people come, visitors, tourists come here each year to have a look at this old library or the long room as it's called. And uh, the Book of Kells. Unfortunately we're not allowed to take any photographs of the Book of Kells itself. It's enclosed under a glass cage just outside this room. A glass uh but as I say, the long room right here is really, really impressive. Every single book written or published in both Great Britain and Ireland, this library here gets a free copy of each book written. They're actually closing down this library come, I think, this September, and they're going to close it down for four years to clean these books, take them down from the bookshelves and clean them. So this library will be closed, as I say, I, I believe it's September, uh, for, as I say, four years. They're starting to take down some of them already, as you can see, on this on one side, but the other sides. got lots of busts throughout the uh, library here too. This is Edmund Burke. He's a writer and a politician in the 1700s. This is the Brian Brew Harp and this is where, this is the national symbol of Ireland. Brian Brew was the High King of Ireland. Ireland is the only country in the world that has uh, their national emblem as a musical instrument, as I say, made famous by Brian Boru, the High King of Ireland, who defeated the Vikings at the Battle of Clontarf in the year 1014. There you can read it, folks. The Brian Brew Harp. So I hope you enjoyed looking at the uh, the long room here at the Trinity College Old Library. Have a great day, folks. Thank you.